What's up, guys? Tom Ladeen here. Going to do a giveaway today. Um, shirts came in. Red Star Lacrosse. With that on the back, nice and big. This is a small. Um, yeah, came out nice. Here's a close up of the bear. Got all the details in there. Screened well. So this time, the last giveaway I did, it was um, it was bonkers. I mean, I had you know hundreds of hundreds of people doing multiple guesses on the numbers and you know non-subscribers and, and just all, it was a mess so this time I'm gonna use one of those randomizers and uh, I'll copy the comments out assign a number to every comment um, and then do the random that random.org pick a random number out of that and then I also want to make I want to get a bunch of subscribers on my um, Instagram account, which right now is kind of lagging. I have, let me see. Instagram is Red Star Lax. And right now I've got 492 subscribers. And on YouTube, I think I've got like 7,200, something like that. So, um, subscribe to Instagram, or follow me on Instagram, Red Star Lax. Uh, make sure you're subscribed in on YouTube, and then um... do all those things, and then I'll pick a random winner. We'll give a T-shirt away. One winner this time, just because it's sort of a headache last time with, I think, five. We'll do um, a Red Star shirt. I'll, I'll find out your size when uh, when you win. And then throw in a piece of Red Star Red, 20 mil. Um, and I think that'll be good. Start, uh, start doing some stuff this summer. Um, so yeah, follow me on Instagram. There's Riley. You know what? I gotta watch this video. There's probably like totally embarrassing photos that have come up. And in like over my head, like my before and after weight loss pics where I'm all, I've never taken those, but that would be funny. Now I'm nervous. Something, something inappropriate is gonna come up. It's just at the beach. Come on, let's go through my family pictures. Here, let's. Oh, there's. There's little guys, Riley and Tanner, playing around in the water park. There's Goji and Zoe eating a tennis ball. <laughs> That's Riley and Tanner in bed. Top bunk, which was Tanner's. Riley must have climbed up there in the night, and he's sleeping right on top of him. That's Riley playing football. All red. Oh, that's somewhere in Mexico. It's me and the boys at the pumpkin patch. Yay! There's Tanner doing a little dance. There's my mom. Tanner, look at that flow. I don't know if you guys can see it. Speaking of flow, <laughs> someone, I was standing next to a group of people at, at a recent tournament, and there were kids, like, like 15, 16 years old, and they were watching a kid who was good. And he's like, oh, that kid's good. He's got no flow, though. And one of the other kids was like, flow? He's like, flow. And this kid goes like this to his hair, and he had like, you know, this much hair sticking out, or out of his hat. He's like, flow. And his friend was looking at him like, dude, what? What, what are you talking about? What? The kid's good at lacrosse. What do you, what do you care about his hair? And um, it just made me chuckle. And then I was thinking about my kids, um, my oldest, who is going into high school, and he's played for six or seven years. 
his first year when he was eight, he had just overflow, really long hair. And no one, I mean, flow was a thing, but it was a thing in hockey, like professional hockey. And it was, you know, that's when they still had mullets and, well, actually, no, seven years ago. So when flow started in the 90s, 80s and 90s, when people started talking about flow, it was Yaramir Jaeger with the, the mullet, you know, that was flow. Um, but in lacrosse, when my kids started, people didn't really talk about flow. It wasn't a thing. And so every game, you know, other team, they thought he was a girl because he was, he was pretty. He was a cute little kid. And the long hair sticking out of his helmet, you know, other coaches would be like, do you have girls on your team? Coach was like, no, no, <laughs> it's fine. He, um, every, every time we went out to eat, they were like, oh, what, what can I get for you, darling? You know? And then to little brother, you know, what about you, buddy? I had little brother, right? It was just, oh, he'd always crack up. And so anyway, he, the first three or four years of lacrosse, he had long hair. And he cut it before he went into sixth grade, I think. He was like, I'm done, it's hot. And then my little guy started growing his. And so as he was getting longer hair, Flo, I mean, people like in the lacrosse community were talking about Flo, 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 oh my gosh, look at his Flo. But still all of his friends were like, man, you gotta cut your hair, what, what the heck? You look like a girl. But he didn't care, neither of them cared. They just do their own thing. But then as soon as it started getting to be a thing, like. Um, at camps and stuff. Oh man, you got sick flow. And Riley would be like, I, I gotta get rid of this. I don't, I don't want to be the kid with flow or, you know, that's my thing. So as soon as it was just getting like, just sick. And I like flow. I mean, here's a picture of me with stupid flow. Overflow. Um, but he, he shaved his head and he was like, duh, I'm done with that. It's nonsense. It's uncomfortable in my helmet have to wear a skull cap to keep it out of my eyes. Um, but anyway, flow. If you have flow, good for you. If you don't, or if you think other people need to have flow, if you're worried about other people's hairstyle, you might be in the, uh, you might be in the wrong business. You know, go, go get your hairdresser's license. I, I, I mean, most dudes do not even ever notice other people's hair. And, and you really shouldn't. Who cares? Who cares what people wear their hair like? I don't know. That's another story. So, let's do this. Subscribe. Follow on Instagram. Follow, uh, like on Facebook. Leave a comment on this video that says your Instagram name. And I will randomize and pick a winner for... The shirt. Red Star Lacrosse shirt. Whatever your size is, we'll figure that out when you win. And the um, Red Star Red 20 mil treated mesh. All right, take it easy. Which one of you schnooks took my rhyme book? Look, give it back, you wicked whack with your ticket.